Affirmations, do they really work? Do they not work? In today's video, I wanna share with you why affirmations don't work. There's so much misinformation about affirmations and yet you sit there and you do them and visualize and your life still looks the same. So if that's you, listen up. My name is Elon Ferdman. I'm a speaker, mentor, and coach, and I've coached tens of thousands of people around this very topic. And the key piece that no one tells you is that when you go out there and say, you know what, I want to lose 50 pounds, or I want to find my soulmate, or I want to generate $10,000 or $50,000 a month, there's two things at play here. There's your desires and spoken word, and there's your subconscious mind, that little boy or girl that's inside of you. And if any of those things that you've stated are not true or to your system feel like a lie, guess what you're actually doing? You're creating the exact opposite result of what you want. Because unless your subconscious mind and your conscious mind are in perfect alignment, you're never gonna produce those results. Because a lie to your system actually creates overwhelm and anxiety because the system says, we can't do that, that's impossible. And it doesn't matter how much you sit there and woo and why and meditate and create vision boards, you're not going to create the result when you have anxiety and overwhelm in your system. So the first thing to understand about proper affirmations is you want to create something that your system is in alignment with and actually feels true. So for example, around your health, you can say something like, I want to be able to go to the gym every single day. See, that's something that the system says, okay, we can do that. And instead of having this unrealistic lie to yourself goal of I'm going to lose 50 pounds, which you've never done before. If you just said, Hey, I'm going to go to the gym three days a week. Your system is going to go like, yeah, I can get behind that. Or if you know that there's some sort of act that you can take in your business, instead of focusing on the money, the 10,000, $50,000 a month, if your thing is, Hey, I get to have one quality conversation with someone every single day. And that feels good and honest and true to you. That's the visualization. That's the affirmation that you want to go after. So stop doing what all these people out there are telling you and create these vision boards with Ferraris and jets and all that stuff, which your system says, heck, I don't believe I can do that. Because what you're actually eliciting is the opposite response of what you're looking for. So the main takeaways here are one, stop saying affirmations that to your system feel like a lie. Look for where your subconscious and conscious mind can align and choose those. So let me know in the comment box below if this makes sense to you. If you see that subtle shift in how you can use affirmations going forward. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please like, comment, and subscribe to our channel. We have a ton more information like this that we release every single week. Have an amazing day.